according to Manley P. Hall, a renowned expert on Freemasonry and esoteric philosophy. Freemasonry can be viewed as a society within a society. This concept is deeply explored in his book, The Lost Keys of Freemasonry, The Inner and Outer Aspects. Hall describes Freemasonry as having both an outer and inner aspect. The outer aspect is the public, visible organization, with its rituals, symbols, and teachings, which are accessible to all members. The inner aspect, however, is a more esoteric and mystical realm, reserved for those who have demonstrated a deeper understanding and commitment to the principles and ideals of Freemasonry, the inner circle. Hall refers to this inner circle as a society within a society, where initiates engage in more profound and symbolic teachings, often drawing from ancient wisdom and mystical traditions. This inner circle is characterized by a focus on spiritual growth, self-discovery, and the pursuit of higher knowledge, the interplay between the two. The interplay between the outer and inner aspects of Freemasonry is crucial, as it allows members to gradually ascend to a deeper understanding of the mysteries. The outer rituals and teachings serve as a foundation, while the inner circle provides a more advanced and nuanced exploration of the symbolism and principles, Manley P. Hall's perspective. In The Lost Keys of Freemasonry, Hall emphasizes the importance of this inner-outer dynamic, stating that Freemasonry is not just a fraternal organization, but a school of wisdom that offers a path to spiritual enlightenment. He argues that the society's esoteric teachings and symbolism hold the key to unlocking the mysteries of life, and that the inner circle provides a sanctuary for those seeking a deeper understanding of the human condition. In summary, Manley P. Hall's perspective on Freemasonry as a society within a society highlights the organization's dual nature, an outer, public aspect and an inner, esoteric realm. This dichotomy allows Freemasons to engage with the mysteries on multiple levels, from the symbolic and ritualistic to the spiritual and mystical.